Okay, okay, okay. We back. We back. We are back. Today, I got Captain Morgan's Cherry Vanilla Rum. Um, shout out to, first of all, Joshua, a.k.a. Snake, um, and Teddy, because, you know, he left a comment for you. Um, shout out to y'all for watching my videos. I appreciate it. Fun fact, my name is Josh, so, yeah, got the little Josh connection right there. Also, shout out to Wait Until 2024. Um, I actually was looking for the P2 Kachacha. Um, I couldn't find it in the store that I usually go to. I think it may be in this other store that I go to, so I'm going to check for that later. Um, but I went to the store looking for the P2, P2 Kachacha rum, but saw this for $14.99. So once I saw this $14.99, I'm like, okay, some new something different it says limited edition so for $14.99 hey go ahead and try it out and I like Captain Morgan it's decent so that's why I went ahead and got it so I already opened it but I'm gonna just smell it again yeah smells like cherry and vanilla Definitely, you smell like it's like a 50 50. You smell both, so that's how it should be. I feel like so. We got the ice, we got the by itself. By itself, we're gonna go ahead and try that. And I just gotta keep it real. I already tried it. I actually did a review and everything, and then it's like the video cut off at the end. Like, I don't know what it is with space. I'm just gonna have to give me a camera because my phone, like, I don't know. But anyway, by itself, we're gonna try it out. Um, of course the smell is a little stronger because it's out the bottle now. It's like a genie in a bottle. It escaped. But. Okay, the taste. First of all, when I seen this, cherry vanilla, I don't like vanilla. Well, I ain't gonna say I don't like it, but it's, I'm not a fan. Like, I'm not gonna go out of my way to get some vanilla. Like, vanilla ice cream by itself, vanilla. It's like extremely boring to me. Like I'm not gonna do it. Uh, any kind of vanilla, vanilla wafers. I don't. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, this right here, as far as the taste, you taste the cherry and the vanilla. So it's like a 50-50 mix. I kind of would say like more so vanilla. Uh, the cherry is there though. Like you can tell there's cherry and vanilla. So that's good because I do like cherry. So I would have preferred if this was just like cherry. So that would have been very nice. But it's good by itself. Um, smooth. Captain Morgan is just smooth to begin with, at least in my opinion. You know, everybody got different opinions. They'll leave comments and all that. I'm not trying to argue or nothing, though. So, hey, you're entitled to your opinion, man. This, this is America. But uh, on the ice. We're going to try this on the ice again, actually. Make sure it's cold. This is how I prefer my drinks on the ice or just cold. I really would say on the ice, depending on what it is. Like if it's something that's a little, little thick or something that's got like a strong taste, calm it down with the ice. But let's just see. With the smell. Now with the smell with this on the ice, you don't smell the cherry really. You smell the vanilla. So, going into this, for me, you know, on the ice, definitely calms down the flavor of it overall. Like, it's not really sweet. Definitely not sweet like how I thought it was going to be, which is very, a very pleasant surprise for me. Uh, but on the ice, it's pretty good. Like, even though I don't like vanilla, it's smooth. It's not, like, thick. It's not thick tasting. It's not super, super sweet. Um, the only thing, once again, you taste the vanilla more than the cherry. So, uh, I guess if you like cherry vanilla Coke or cherry vanilla Pepsi or, like, what, a cherry Pepsi or something, this would be good. I just thought about that. Like, that would be real good. I might try that. But, yeah, on the ice... Tastes good, even though I'm not a vanilla fan. So, still smooth, still tastes good. So, still drinkable. 
uh, honestly, after like after I purchased it, I was thinking like, man, I might not even drink this. Like, uh, this might be like the first bottle I give away or something. Like, but it actually tastes decent, so I will be keeping it and I will be drinking it. So, so as far as the ratings, I'm gonna be more precise with my ratings. Uh, I feel like I didn't gave away a lot of sevens, uh, and I'm not, I'm not sure if everything was just like a seven. So I'm gonna be more precise as far as like breaking it down with the decimals. So by itself, um, I would say by itself tastes pretty good. Like, hey, I know I might say that about a lot of stuff, but it's like I, I just I have good judgment. So I don't really try bad stuff to where it'd be like a three or something. Plus, if I did, I might go back to the store and ask for a refund or something. But anyway, uh, seven. I, I, I was not. Nah, I was by itself. I give it like a six point nine. See, just by like, come on, by by default, I just said seven, but six point nine by itself. Um, it's good. It's above average. So on a scale from one to ten, it's above average, but slightly. Like for me at least, because I don't like vanilla like that. But it is smooth and it's, it's drinkable, so 6.9. Um, on the ice, even though once again still has a stronger vanilla taste, on the ice, smoother, and I just like cold drinks, so it tastes better on the ice to me. Um, it make it makes it even more smoother. So on the ice, I give it like a 7.2, 7.3 or something. It's pretty good. Um, wouldn't be a go-to for me, but I would say it's worth trying if you like cherry vanilla. Like, if you like cherry vanilla, you might love it. Like, I just don't like vanilla, so I was like, I'm just, I'm on the cherry side of things. But it's pretty good. So, overall, I guess that would average this out overall to be like a 7.1 or something. Um, it's pretty good. I thought it was going to be horrible, but it's pretty good. I'm still trying to get the P2 Kachacha. I hope I'm saying that right. If I'm not saying that right, hey, I think it's like Brazilian or something. So, hey, you can't blame me. It's not like it's like a, a regular word or something. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty good. If you like cherry vanilla, you'll like it. Hey.